The Georgia State Patrol used a pit maneuver on a driver who led them and Coweta County deputies on a high-speed chase down I-85 this weekend. Fox 5's Doug Evans reports on the drug and gun charges the driver and his son now face. Driver Darius Davis of Morrow was a wanted man, according to Coweta deputies, so when they tried to pull the 39-year-old over on I-85 on Saturday, they say he sped away, eventually reaching speeds at over 150 miles per hour. They say they would later find drugs and a weapon in his car. The deputies found 31 individually packaged bags of marijuana, and each one had a label of 3.5 grams on it. They also found 20 grams of shrooms. Deputies say Davis was with his 21-year-old son, Mondarius Davis of Noonan, who was riding in the passenger seat. At over 100 miles per hour, the father's car can be seen passing other drivers on the shoulder of the freeway. Yeah, he was passing um, cars in the emergency lane on, on both sides of the interstate, uh, extremely reckless throughout the chase. The chase went off the highway and into the south end of Coweta County onto rural roads, still at over 100 miles an hour. Back on the interstate, Coweta deputies closed down the highway to let the chase speed by. The Georgia State Patrol had joined the pursuit, and the video shows the trooper performed the pit maneuver at over 100 miles per hour. Good pit, good pit, good pit. Bad 1050 into the wall. Go ahead and start us with EMS. Bad 1050. Down. After the wreck, Mondarius Davis can be seen crawling from the car. Moments later, his father also would crawl from the wreckage. The elder Davis is facing charges of possession of a controlled substance, possession of a firearm, and the commission of a crime, fleeing and attempting to elude, speeding, reckless driving, and possession of marijuana with intent to distribute. His son is charged with one count of possession of Scheduled 1 THC oil. In Coweta County, Doug Evans, Fox 5 News.